And just what do we have over here, hmm? It looks like a family of coyotes. Oh, look, Genesis is actually coming up around the other side. Is that coyotes or... <gasps> is that a stranger wolf? Okay, that's not cool. What do you guys think you're doing here? Oh my gosh, there's stranger wolves here, you guys. Not good. Not good at all. Who do you think you are? Get out of here. Oh my goodness, this is not good at all. I thought those were maybe coyotes. These are actually stranger wolves in our area. There's two male dispersal wolves. Ah! Why? Why can we not have just like one quiet day? Poor Meadow already just literally chased away a grizzly bear last time, friends. I just can't believe this. Also, apologies, but come on, this is dramatic. We need to chronicle the moments of Meadow's life going on here. All right, let's get away, please. All right. Yeah, no, you guys are not allowed to run that way. Get out of here. Like, you guys need to... We'll fight. Okay. There's, this is another dispersal wolf like yourself. They aren't looking for trouble, but they may fight if you insist. Okay. We need to, like, insist they get out of here. Seriously? Like, get out of here. Okay. Not good. Not good at all. Are they headed towards our den? Vaguely? Vaguely? They kind of are? All right, we need to make sure these guys get out of here. This is why, that's it, that's it. That's absolutely it. Phew, okay, so they seem to be like running for it now. But all right, well, welcome back to Wolf Quest 3, everyone, where we are here with Meadow and Genesis of the Moon Pack, as Meadow has just come to the absolute deep determination that she is 100% done with this den. This den, like we've got Prospect Peak kind of coming around our, our way, which is not good. We have got a grizzly bear that actually just showed up at this den. We need to move our pups and we actually found another den that will do. But I wanted to move them when we're a little bit stronger and we actually are out on the hunt right now trying to find some food, trying to make sure that we shore up some of our territory that we're really at risk of losing because we haven't been able to go down in that direction for so long and doing our best to recover from the wounds that we still are very sore from after a terrible battle with Prospect Peak Pack. Whew, this is gonna be a bit of a challenge, especially, oh good, a mule deer's nearby. All right, let's see if we can trace down. There's more male dispersal wolves from the avalanche pack? We just ran into a whole different group of them. Okay, we definitely want to make sure that they know this is like our territory. Get out of here. You guys are not allowed over here where they might like cause us to lose our pups or be at risk. So there's more dispersal males nearby. And I think they're actually like pushing in on our mule deer population which is absolutely not good, because that's also ours. We need those, we're very hungry. Oof. Okay, let's see. That's reinforced, let's try going this direction for now. And, oh good, mule deer tracks. Excellent. Oh, there! Excellent, excellent, excellent! Go, 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 Meadow! We just literally stumbled on this deer! We must have spooked it with our howling, I hope. All right. Oh, mule deer, come on. We're gonna need to really work on our burst of stamina. But if we can just take her down, then we might be able to go ahead and have the strength we need to recover from all the battling with the other wolves we've been doing. And then get to the point where we can actually go ahead. All right, come on, Genesis. Get to the point where we can actually go ahead and move our pups. All right, this deer seems a little bit confused, too. All right, I need to gather a little more energy. There we go. Genesis, good job, good job. If we can take her down together, she should be enough to feed on to get our food up and get the pup's strength up so that they'll be able to actually go ahead and move to a new den because Meadow is so done with this den. All right, come on. 
Now she's finally figured out how to get to open ground. Just as I need the stamina to really chase her. Go, Genesis, go! Oh, don't let her get across the river! All right, maybe if we go this way. And kind of spook her this direction. Get out of here, Fox! Okay, good, good, good. There she goes, come on. Away from the river, away from the river, away from the river! Thank you, away from the river. That's also closer to another wolf's territory, and we do not want to have to put up with that. Oh, she's given us some good kicks, and I think Meadow's actually really worn out from diving into the river, too. Oh, we need this food. Oh, Genesis, you need rest. Holy cow. Phew, okay, I'm so glad we were able to take her down. Our wolves have been through so much. I'm really nervous about this. All right, we need all of the food we can get. Let's leave that meat piece alone. I might be able to carry that back home. Apparently I'm just ripping off chunks of meat instead of eating off the carcass. Not good. All right, let's go. We've got this meadow. Now we're starting to fill up enough to be able to feed the pups, I think. Excellent, excellent. And then can I grab... Are we hungry enough to eat it? Not yet. Excellent, okay. So let's go ahead and we're going to get back to... All right, do I smell anything weird? Any more dispersals nearby? Uh, we probably should defend a whole bunch of our territory over to the west, but because there's dispersals nearby, because we just ran into a grizzly bear, because we really want to get a move on, we're going to head back to the den, we're going to feed the pups, we're going to rest, and then we're going to try to move them. Genesis's health is not looking good. The more rest we can give him, the better. If needed, we might be back to try hunting more of these mule deer, but we'll have to see how that goes. And there's no sense in the snow at the moment. It'll be a pity to put a bit of distance between us and the McBride Creek, because that is actually a beautiful creek that Meadow really enjoys being near. But perhaps because the creek attracts so many different types of animals down to it to be able to drink the water there, it just seems like a really contested place. There's just a lot going on. All right, are we getting closer to home? I hope. I don't need any... What's this? Oh, lucky rabbit's foot. All right, well, I've already got what we need, but hopefully that's a good sign. Here, pups. I might try hunting down that lucky rabbit's foot real quick. Well, it probably got away by now. But you know, every little bit might help and maybe that would be a good thing. But the pups are out of the den right now and I don't want to run too far away from them, just in case, especially with those stranger wolves nearby. Ooh, let's slow down a little. Can I get this chunk of meat, please? There we go. They're still too small to be able to eat up. They are Arrow, Calypso, Achilles, Marigold. Phew! Oh wait, what was that? Was that the bunny? Yes, it was the lucky rabbit's foot nearby. Oh! There we go. And Achilles, the smallest, is going ahead and getting a little bit more to eat. Thank goodness. Oh, look, he and Parsley are playing together. All right, how are they doing now? Parsley, Marigold, and Calypso, our girls, are once again the biggest and getting very close to finally being about 13 pounds. That's excellent. And once they get there, we'll just be a little bit, a little bit, like we're so close and yet so far. I really wanna move from this den, but the puppies are growing. We need to heal up first things first, though, so let's go ahead. While everybody plays, let's let Meadow have a moment's rest. Achilles has come to sleep up against our side. I would love to know who your favorite pups are so far. Watching their personalities really develop as we wander around. There's Marigold. And as time passes, it's just so exciting. Oh my gosh, look at them. I mean, I wish we had had more time with Bluebell and we had had more time with Daisy, 
but unfortunately they did not make it which is why I'm trying to enjoy the time we have with all the others <laughs> all right looks like they're getting fed over here and actually it looks like we're doing pretty good so let's feed the pups and then I think we're going to begin our journey to a new area Especially because Prospect Peak really seems to be determined to solidify their strength in this zone, but not so much to the north. And I, I'm just, oof, I'm just so nervous. So yeah, we're gonna move to a new den for sure. Let's go ahead and I guess, oh, I should have marked that spot so I knew to head towards that direction, but that's okay. All right, you guys need more food? Marigold? There you go. Yeah, affinity is about as high as it can get. I think the pups are about as well fed as they can possibly get. We'll go ahead and play just a little bit more. Marigold, do you want to grab a little bit more to eat from the pile before we leave? Oh good, she is. Excellent. And Achilles too. Achilles and Arrow, our two boys, really need whatever food they can get. So the pups are almost 100% fed. <gasps> Parsley is so big now. She's 13 pounds now, you guys. We're so close. I'm so tempted to just stay at this den when we're so close, but I, I really just don't trust this den. I mean, ah, oh, but we're so close. Maybe we could just go ahead and get to the summer hunting grounds. But the other den is nearby, and it's also further into more established territory. So you know what? Whew. We're gonna risk it. Okay, let's do this. We're gonna move dens. All right. Let's do this, you guys. Come along, pups. We're moving dens. Calypso and Arrow are the first ones to follow us. We're gonna be headed basically straight this way. All right, Marigold, Achilles, Parsley. Calypso, and we're off. Do I smell anything funky? Female dispersal wolves from Toad Flax Pack, okay. There's another elk herd somewhere nearby. Hopefully we can make it Arrow, Calypso, Achilles. Marigold, stay close. This is very nerve wracking. Very nerve-wracking. Oh, jeez, we're still so far away. But I think even though this is a little frightening to go ahead and try to move dens, the puppies are getting bigger. And I feel like Calypso, come on. Marigold, come on. Their affinity is as high as it could be. Genesis is being good and watching in the background. Oh, Parsley tripped over her own paws. I dislike hearing that eagle. Oh, are we getting close? Okay, we're actually getting kind of close to the new den. And hopefully, this is a lot of exposed ground. I don't like that. Come on, you three. The girls are over there. The boys are at the front. Arrow's very fast. Even though he's a bit smaller, he and his brother are both smaller. Okay, don't like seeing the crows. You guys can just leave. Do not give away the fact that our pups are here. There's Marigold. Alright, closing in, closing in, getting close. Oh, it's just the bison. Oh, alright, let's keep going. Come on, pups. Okay, are we getting closer? I think so. And the terrifying sounds we suddenly heard were just the bison. Okay, here it is, here it is! Oh, thank goodness! Oh, I feel like boulders have just rolled off of my shoulders. Here we are, a new den for the pups. There's some bison nearby. This is going to be the moss, uh, moss stump? Huh. We're gonna, the moss tree, moss tree den. And hopefully, like many things mossy in our lives, that will just bode well for the future. Yay! All right, your pups will call this home until it's time to journey to the new site. Oh, thank goodness. Oh, 
a journey to the new den. Holy cow, that really, that really worried me quite a bit. I'm not gonna lie, but we've made it. Genesis is playing, Achilles and Arrow are happy. The affinity with the pups are great. And Parsley is right over to the side too. Ah, oh, you guys, I'm so relieved. <laughs> So all right, now that we have made it to the new den, I just feel that Meadow feels that this is better. This is not going to be quite as risky as trying to defend the old den down here, especially with Prospect Peak and all those dispersal wolves. Hopefully we can shore up our strength over to our west and over to our east as well. And then if, even if we don't move up to that den that she kind of had her eye on, I feel like this is a central enough point that we should hopefully be able to take good care of our pups, especially because they are getting so, so close to being able to be old enough to journey to the summer hunting ground. So if you guys could, do please leave a like for Meadow and Genesis, Marigold, Forso, Parsley, Arrow, Achilles. Calypso is chasing her own tail again and the success that we have had in getting here. And if you would like to join us on this and literally thousands more adventures, do please consider subscribing. But most importantly, my friends, stay curious, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye.